So one of the challenges that we see quite regularly, both in financial services and not, is disparate teams between sales and marketing, that difference between the people who are generating the leads and the people who are qualifying those leads. How we can potentially look at bringing those two things together as far as having the same, the same system, the same tools, the same view of the customer and starting to pull together that picture of what everybody's doing. It's asked for a lot um, by, as I say, both financial services organisations and through broader organisations. So the way that technology can start to address some of those challenges is particularly with Dynamics Marketing and with products like Customer Insights. We have now got the room to bring those systems, those processes that would typically exist outside in the realm of marketing in isolation from our core CRM system and look at how we can bring that into the platform. Once you do that, you have all of that transaction history, that engagement, those lovely breadcrumb trails of where a person came from and the journey that they went through to become a customer or to become a prospect, they start to exist inside the core CRM, which gives access to that information to our sales teams, to our engagement teams, to our development teams, and ultimately potentially even to our customer service teams later down the line when you start to look at that. And that is a fully well-rounded view of a customer. So where Customer Insights starts to add to that is that it starts to allow external data sources to come into play. So where our Dynamics Marketing gives us access to inside system teams like customer service team, our complaints management team, our sales team, our marketing team, we then with Customer Insights can start to look at other environments, other databases, third party data sets that can start to augment and enrich that data. They then fit in so lovely to the front of our Dynamics Marketing process that then suddenly together, they are giving us both the view of the customer inside the organisation, inside the environment, and actually a broader and more richly developed picture of the customer from other sources as well. So the value that that can bring to an organisation is probably best summed up by just imagining you are one of those people in that scenario. So I am a, a, an advisor and I sit down with a, a customer or a prospect as part of that, that sort of initial engagement. I don't know them very well, I've never maybe met them before. And by bringing customer insights and dynamics marketing into potentially a, a, an existing um, organisation or an existing implementation even, um, I know what their engagement has been up to now, how they got here what path they took as far as were they interested in one product and another and then ultimately they decided to go with one thing instead you know and you know all of those things start to come into play because the visibility of the journey that they've been on that that, that prospect to customer journey starts so much earlier when we have the customer insights and the dynamics marketing inside our system so if you want to find out more about this you can have a look at the fsi hub on the incremental website um, or in fact, connect with me directly on LinkedIn.